Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to another video, and in today's video I'll be doing another challenge since the last one did so well. I got these Marvel collectible minifigures and I wanted to use them in a stop motion. So I challenged myself to make a stop motion in 2 minutes, 20 minutes, and 2 hours using these Marvel minifigures. So first up is the 2 minute stop motion. You can't do much in 2 minutes, so I want to recreate that thing Captain America does where he kicks the shield up to his hand. To do this, I had to take his knee out of the socket to make it look like he's raising it. And there's the 2 minute stop motion. I think it looks pretty good for 2 minutes. Moving on to the 20 minute stop motion, I have a lot more time and freedom, so I want to try to recreate Wanda's red magic. I detached her arms and stuck them back on using sticky tack to make them look like they're bending. After I finished animating, I added red lines to try to recreate her magic. And this is the final product. I think I could have done the magic a bit better, but overall, I think it's pretty good. And finally, the two hour stop motion. Two hours gives me so much time, I can even do some set design. So I made a background with sky, clouds, and buildings for Spider-Man to swing across. After I finished recording Spider-Man swinging, I did some masking. I wanted to do some sort of superhero landing, so I took off Spider-Man's arms and legs. I don't think it looked that good in the end though. I drew some blue squiggles to try to recreate the Spidey Sense effect. And this is the two hour stop motion. I think it's actually pretty good. I really like the web swing effect, but the masking is pretty sloppy. I also like the slow-mo effect. Comment which stop motion you thought was the best and what theme you want me to do next for this type of challenge. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and thanks for watching.